people of the internet, and welcome back. We are playing on the Time Shot server. Woohoo! We are going to start basically building our house, apart from this lovely door frame that we did. I mean, it, it really makes this place, don't you think? So, I am going to get started. So, as I mentioned in the previous video, I am not a person that usually builds on camera. I usually derp around and mess up and remove blocks and add blocks and remove blocks and things like that. Now, I have built this building creative to a degree, but I'm still not 100% happy with it, so I will probably play around with it and change things up as we go, but I am using a few calculations like how far away certain things are to make it all look nice. Um, but yeah, so we'll see how we go, and we'll just basically start here. So we're going to build kind of an archway. We need dirt on our bar. There we go. So we want to go up seven here. And um, the only reason I never used to build in creative first, but the only reason I started doing that was because it is very hard for me to kind of, I, I struggle not building in creative first now because I'm all over the place with my building. But we'll see, I, I will do spontaneous builds as well. So don't use stress, it's not all gonna be pre-planned stuff. But for my base, I'd like it to be pre-planned. Now, if we jump and we'll remove the scaffolding after. I mean, we want our, our first build on time shot to look good. We don't want it to be not looking too good. But um, yeah, I basically just mathematically plan it out in um, creative. Otherwise, it's very kind of tricky. I don't know um, how many other people do that. I never used to do it. But yeah, so one, two, three, four, five. And then I think it's a six here. Let's have a look. We'll see how this looks. Oh, there we go. Yeah, get rid of the scaffolding. We're going to need to make new tools too. So there's that. And then what we want to do is... I think it's going to be like this. That lines up with this here. Now I don't think they will touch, but for now they do. Okay, up we go. <laughs> It's kind of, yeah. Nope. We're in the way. That one. Then come down in a staircase like fashion. There we go. So we want that one hanging off by itself. So, what I then want to do is we're actually going to remove this, this. Oh, there we go. I don't think we have another axe. We have a couple of pickaxes on us. Let's grab three of these. We can use the wood we've got on us. Create a couple of sticks like this, and we'll make another axe. Um, I haven't gone and um, made any gear yet with the other stuff. I've pretty much only logged on for this um, since building the archway and the fence. So, yeah, but I will get geared up and things like that. At the moment, I'm not too stressed about it. Now, what we want to do is then fill the rest in. Like this. Jump. Okay. Now, on the inside, it'll probably be all filled in properly, but we'll we'll sort that out. We'll we'll work on the inside on another day. Oh, we don't want to do that. Fall down. And that comes down to here. Close that in there. I think that's how I want that. I'm not sure how we're gonna do the door. Alright, now let's have a look. I think that's looking pretty good. I like that. Um, now, it's a very bland, like, blank build at the moment, but we are going to spruce it up with some leaves and vines and some different types of wood. So what we're going to do first is we're going to get our jungle wood. I don't think we have it. Do we have it on us? We have a little bit of jungle wood on us. Do we have any more? I did head to the jungle. It looks like we've used... Oh, there it is. Dinner inventory. What are you doing, Pudsy? All right. Now, we won't use the wood for sticks. There we go. Now, always get this mixed up, but I'm pretty sure this is going to be a fence here. All right. Let's just make a couple. We don't need that many fences. We're not going to be making too many fences here, but we will do that, I think. And then do we have some, we do have some leaves on us. Look at us. All so prepared. All right. 
Something like that. Mm. Oops, I should have used shears. I'm a terrible person. And I may actually put some dirt here. And it'll grow and things. But we, we can play around with that. Now, I did get some vines because I did run around getting stuff for this. Um, and we did go to the jungle. Now, what we're going to do is chuck a vine there, chuck a vine there. No, bad. For now, they can go there. Um, I will drape leaves over the edge here, but I'm just not sure, like, where I want them in comparison to, like, the roof. But, like, something like that, basically. Um, let's see. Let's move that. That one. Come here. Come here, leaf. All right. So, as you can see, it's kind of coming together. Now, the door is actually going to be jungle wood. So let's grab some more jungle wood, make a door. Ta-da. We'll make three doors, actually. Oh, our inventory is full. Well, we don't need that. Then... Plant that there. Perfect. Ah. Now, do we want this? We need to do that. Is that about right? I think it is. So the the vines will grow down themselves, so I don't want to I don't have to waste using more vines. That's the key to that. Um oh, I probably need some of that maybe. Now, do we have any more? We need some more dark oak. Yes, we do. Thought I got enough. Now I don't think I need the jungle wood yet anymore. I don't need any gravel. Ah, cobblestone. Now, I thought that this would look kind of nice. So uh, actually, I think I'll use... Do we have our stairs on us? No. I think we have cobblestone stairs. No, we don't. Okay. Well, let's just do this then. Alright, so... For this side, I thought... Uh, we're gonna have to... That's fine. So like that. And then we're gonna actually have to break that line too. That's okay. And then, just to make it a little bit different on this side. Um, and move from there. And yeah, just to add a little bit more features to the build, I think. I might change that up, I'm not sure. Um, and we'll actually, uh, we need our vines again. Grab those. There we go. And so vines grow... Oh, I'm over the fence. Vines grow by themselves, so you only need to use the top half of them, which is handy. Now, we need to finish off this part. So, oops. All right. So this is going to be three. Well, they're all going to be three. And we will... Whoops. My placement skills today are a bit off. That's okay. So there are th this one's three wide. All right. Do the other side. And down. So this side over here touches the ground where the other one won't touch the ground. But a little bit off balance would look good. It might not, but I think it does. I think it looks all right. All right. Now, this is where then... Oh, we've got to go... Th yeah, we're three back. So then we can fill in these so that the inside of the house, you can't even tell that there's like a kind of different design there. Now, we need to... After the three, we need to go back six. So one, two, three, four, five... Oh, five, six... Two, three, four, five, six. Now I don't. One, two, three, four, five, six. And I'll terraform around the build too. So I want it to kind of work with the land to a degree, but I also want it to look nice and things, and I don't want to just have to rely on the land the whole time. So we will alter it a bit, but that's okay. 
two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five. Now we should probably swap to the other side. Um, pop some torches up here so that nothing spawns. We do not want any nasties on our house. Go. Oh, see, this is what happens when I try and do two. Alright. Go. And last one. Five, six. So this is like the inside. Now I probably will move the ground up here. So if we just kind of, well, I think this will actually be removed and be placed as the floor of the building. So I'm not overly concerned about that. All right, guys. So I completely messed up. It's four in. So one, two, three, four. And then I wanted to drop down. That's why I left this gap here, like to make sure that I knew that. But clearly I don't even know my own kind of notifications in here. But that's okay. And then it does drop down one more time. Just so that it comes down the... Oops. Comes down the mountain. Alright. Then... From here, we are going to move remove all the dirt. Because I don't want dirt in my house. I'd like a clean house. Um, just to make sure that we don't get any... Well, as an Australian, you have to have a clean house, obviously. Um, otherwise, you get spiders and all kinds of things. I mean, you get spiders anyway. But yeah, we definitely want to keep a clean house. And then what we want to do is go back four more times. Now the tree is going to get in the road. Three, four. Now, Mr. Mr. Dark Oak Tree, we need to cut you down. I am very sorry. I will replant. I will replant you. But you'll have to be elsewhere. All right. So let me just cut this down. And then we should be good to nearly close off the um, build because it's once we go the four, we're going to add a little bit more detail to it. And then we're pretty much done with the outside of the building, which is excellent. Now, I've only pre-planned the outside and I think I might spontaneously do the inside with you guys. Um, so let me know what you think, what kind of rooms that I should have. I mean, it's only going to be very small. It's only going to have a main room. And then it is actually... So I did dig... I will show you guys. Well, there's this area. I need to get rid of this clay, but there is like a little room in here. As you can see. So I will work with this somehow, but I can't go too far down because I noticed that there's tunnels under here. So I'm guessing it's someone's kind of mining tunnel or it's a base or something like that. And that's, I don't think it's a base. I think it's just a mine. Let's just pop that back. Nothing ever happened. You can't tell I went there at all. <laughs> so that's now despawning. So we can then continue along. So it's four out. One, two, three, four. Excellent. Excuse me, leaves. Sorry. Thank you for the sapling, though. All right. Good jump. Now we should be able to just remove these. There we go. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Three, four. One, two, three. Now, I think that I'm gonna have to bring it down and things like that, but that's basically the build. And let's have a look here. Give me a minute, guys. Okay, guys, so let's eat this cookie. Um, I took a minute. I know I was just meant to be sorting out this area here, but it just wasn't looking right. I'm not sure how I feel about this little bit here. I think I want to kind of bring it in again like that. I think it was meant to be in a little bit. Maybe take this one off as well, maybe. I don't know. 
It's meant to be kind of, yeah. How about that? Does that work? Maybe a little bit better. But yeah, so I finished off the back because I was going to do it on camera. And as I said, I'm trying to build on camera, but at times it's just a bit frustrating for me when I'm trying to do different things like this. Um, but I do need to now like terraform this to have it so that that's like the next level of ground. Um, I'm not sure um, why, but I didn't change anything, but it seems to be up a level higher. Um, so I don't know if something's a bit different. Um, but I can like make this look natural here anyway, so it should look all right. Um, and we can just kind of like add our kind of make, I want it to look natural. I don't want it to kind of look forced. So we're going to have to move that tree. Um, but that's okay. I can move the trees around. I definitely still want that. We like definitely still want the trees down the back here. Um, but yeah, so let's just kind of like that. See how now it, like, it looks like it's built into the landscape. Now I'm sure, if, and I got the hanging of this over a bit more, um, I'm sure if we head on inside that it's going to look crazy in here. It does. And our shovel's going to break. That's okay though. We, we need a crafting table to make a shovel. Hold on. One second. Now, for the inside, I'm going to do that in the next episode, guys. So I'm sorry about that. Um, but we're not finished just yet. Need a couple. We don't need a proper shovel. No iron shovels around here. All right. So let's remove all the dirt anyway. Oh, okay. That's the outside world. Okay. Now, that's where we are going to need to bring down the like um the walls inside. So that should definitely be that. So we like close it in like this. I think that these are scaffolding. Yep. Okay, so now that's the outside world again. So if we bring this down, and then that'll be scaffolding. So we can bring that there. Outside world, outside world. See, I'm getting better. I know what I'm doing. <laughs> And then, I guess this will be our wall line anyway, so that's okay. I'm not sure where the floor is going to be going here. Is that outside? Yes, it is. Uh, whoops. Well, yeah, so we'll probably just make the main outside there, like the wall there, like that. And we'll, we'll sort something out. Might just bring that in like that to make it look even a bit more. So the, both the sides of the build are actually different anyway. So I need to kind of balance it and figure out what we're doing inside here. Um, might like, what I might do is bring this in a level so that we can mirror that. Is that better? Yeah, so see how it's like kind of getting mirrored now? Because the inside build, although it's off-center, that's annoying. Good job, me, with the off-centered build. But yeah, we can play around with this kind of stuff and make sure that the roofing and everything... Uh, the build is off-centered, so it's not meant to look symmetrical, which is kind of frustrating for me because I am very OCD about that, but at the same time, I wanted to challenge myself. So this will drop down into an area down here, and I think the area will actually be up here, so you won't even see down there. Um, I might make a little storage area or something like that. But yeah, so let's actually get to decorating the outside of the house. The inside is for the next episode. Um, as you can see, the vines have grown. Yay. So we need vines and we need this. And actually what we need, we need to kind of empty out our inventory. Okay, get rid of all this. I think we need the stairs. I think I need to make some more stairs, so I need some more cobble. Thank you. And then I need... Where is it? Where did we put it? Do we have it still in our inventory? No, we don't. Jungle wood. You're probably like, what are you doing with jungle wood? It's all. But we're going to see how it looks. So with this, we want to actually... Oh, we need that. We're actually going to break it up a little bit. 
just randomly not I'm not using my um whoops I don't want to do that one though I'm not using my build idea for this one this is kind of I like the being spontaneous with this kind of stuff because I think it makes it look more natural so it's not all calculated and looking the same um but yeah let's start there um probably stick away from the front row though uh, that one was fine because it's behind a leaf, so you won't see it as much, but otherwise it's going to kind of conflict with the other cobble showing through. And then like this. Maybe two more. That one. And then maybe this one. There we go. So that kind of breaks it up a little bit. Can I pick that up, please? There we go. Kind of just adds a little bit more texture to it. And then what I want to do with this is have a couple of these. Uh, and kind of do the same thing. Randomly create some holes and add in a different kind of color. Nothing like majorly different, but yeah. It, well, it is quite different actually. It stands out quite a lot. Uh, these all in the same room nearly. I'm going to bring that one in a level. Whoops. Really hard not falling into your build. All right, I actually want to put this one here. And then that. Grab that back. Uh, and then this one can go here. Oh, wrong tool. No, no. There we go. Okay. That one can go there. That one can go here. And this one. Yeah. Now that's not the only randomizing I'm going to be doing, so just give me a minute to quickly kind of pop these in place. Uh, we'll put this one here. Oops, like that. And then this one, hmm. I feel like we want to put two here. One here and one here. There we go. Kind of just breaks it up a little bit. We're going to do the same to the back area, so we're going to need some more jungle. A little bit. Trying to kind of break up the build a little bit. Sometimes a bit too much dark oak can just overdo it. Now, let me know what you guys think of this. I'm not sure how I feel about the mixed blocks here, or if they, they work together. I think they do. They look kind of nice. I like the brightness of the jungle compared to the dark oak. Like, it's a nice contrast. But they could look terrible to you guys, so let me know what you think. And if there's a better kind of wood that you think would work, let me know, and I might give it a go. Give it a good shot and see how we go. That one. And then the only other thing I think I want to do... Oh, why is there nothing here for me? We'll have to remove that from the inside. Uh, like this one, and I think, whoops, good job me. Now I know it looks really weird in here, but we can like fix this up. There's no issues, we can all sort that out, so I feel like we need one like right here. Oh, not a torch please, that one. No, we actually, oops, might actually put a torch there. There we go. So a little bit of differentiation there. And then what I actually want to do also is... No, we don't have the right stuff. We're actually going to put some logs as well. I think... Hmm. I think that's what I want to do. So we're going to give it a go. Maybe not put them so close together each time. But, you know, a bit, bit of a difference. Uh... That one here. So let's see how that looks. Yeah, so it just texturizes it, and then once we add the leaves, you won't even really notice it anyway. But that's okay. Um, like this one. Uh, not like that though. I need to add it on its side. Not going to unless I have something there. So let's just pop this here. Go. Um, this one. So just a bit all over the place. 
nothing, nothing permanently like picked out in my build for creative. I just kind of added it to one side of the build and thought, hey, that looks all right. Um, see this one here. And then for the back, I don't know. Maybe placing it against the way that the other ones are going? I don't know. How does that look? Yeah, maybe like that to make it look like this. The planks don't... Mm, maybe not, because then it looks a bit weird with the planks going the other way. So let's place a thing here. There we go. What would actually look kind of cool, I think, is making it look like it's a log here. I can kind of make it look like we're living out of a log. Kind of like that. Something like that. I don't know. Might not work. I don't think it does. Kind of looks a bit funny. Hmm. Might sort something out, though. Um, let's just do that. And wait, that's going the wrong way, isn't it? GG me. I'm gonna pop a log in here so I know to get rid of it. Yeah, so this kind of just got to put too many of these, something like that, and maybe one. There we go. So it just adds a little something and then we can go around with our leaves. Oh, well, I don't want leaves there, buddy. Kind of, whoops. You can't, you can't stand where you want to place things, otherwise you place a torch. And that one. Just kind of random. Going off the build. And then on the other... Oh, we better put some here. This one needs this here. They're a bit close together. That one. Oh, you ran out of leaves? Okay. Well, we might need to grab some more leaves. I wonder if we have any. Let's have a look. Otherwise, we might grab some from here. Two. Yes. Jump. And then... And then maybe like this. And then what we want to do is add some... Oh. Okay, well it can go on that leaf. Add some vines that will eventually grow. Now we're going to have to keep an eye on them though. Because we don't want them overtaking the build. So we're going to have to trim them every now and again, I think. But that's okay. Uh, eh. And we might even do one coming this way. And kind of like this, something like that. I kind of like that. Um, we'll move on there. All right, so kind of get all different angles. So this is basically how it looks from the kind of behind the portal here. Um, let's just eat our cookies quickly because we've been jumping all over. So once you come out of the nether portal, you just see this, which is kind of nice. Nice little bit of greenery. I think I've got maybe too many leaves at the front, but we can order, um, edit that. And yeah, so basically, guys, that's going to be the outside of the build. And then in the next episode, we're going to do inside this mess. <laughs> kind of left a bit messy, but yeah. So thank you so much for watching, guys. Um, leave a like if you enjoyed this video, and I will see you guys next time. Bye!